Hi, my name is Ralph Carbone, and I'm a docent here at the California Auto Museum. Today I'm standing in front of the EV1, which is uh, manufactured by General Motors, and it was considered uh, the first electric car in the modern era. The government uh, had put out a proposal to all the car manufacturers in America to uh, do a feasibility study on producing an electric vehicle, and General Motors was the only company that actually stepped up to do it. They ultimately manufactured around 1,200 of these cars, these vehicles. They didn't sell any to anybody. They, what they did was they leased them to corporations across the United States and let all their employees drive them for uh, about a six-year period. All the employees loved these cars, but uh, at the end of that feasibility study, General Motors put together a report to the government and indicated that it wasn't feasible to make these cars. They just weren't cost-effective. And it turned out they didn't tell the truth in that story. And a movie was made, subsequently made, Who Killed the Electric Car, as a result. But, uh, but they ended up taking all those cars back and destroyed them all. They crushed them all with only maybe a handful left. And we were fortunate enough to be one of them to have one example here. The Smithsonian Institution has another one. But uh, it's, it's a rare thing to be able to see one of these in a music, car museum. So we're very fortunate to have it. Um, and we've even got it complete with a charging station. And here in front, you see we've got placards that describe a little bit of history, give you a little bit of a story on the car. Uh, like all our cars in the museum, we have the similar placards and tell the stories, but uh, we're interested in hearing your story and looking forward to seeing you here.